but time for the next action of the day. It is that Bambino of Sophie Hay who is out on circuit. And when I turn around about here, the uh, the microphone should come back on. So if I want to if I want to swear, I turn away. <laughs> if I don't want to swear, I face you. Right, she comes in. Let's see if there's uh, the spin at the start line again. I don't think there is going to be this time. She's remembered to stop. All right then, Bambinos. Sophie Hay, ready to go. Green flags in the hand of the starter, and away we go. Sophie, heads up. We'll see uh, how many laps we're going to have. Five. All right, five laps it is for Sophie. See if we can get down to a 35 second lap. That is the aim. We've had a 36. Can we get a 35? Down the hill she comes. Through infinity and beyond. You like that? See what I did there? Going into Ludby Car Supplies and back onto the Bendigo Bank Main straight away she will go. The next class won't be too far away. They'll be getting ready in the out grid very soon. We got nobody up there yet. Where are they? <laughs> 44 seconds is the opener. Down she comes then. 44 seconds for the first one. It's gonna have to knock at least five seconds off that, I'd say. Could well be possible on the opening fast lap. 41.671 was recorded on the last one. Over the line, Sophie A completes another one and does a 40.849. Not up to speed yet, then you can see she's not quite up to full pace. Three laps in which to try to get down to a 35. We're willing her on to a 35 second lap. Can she get there? Down through Ludby Cart Supplies. On to the Bendigo Bank Main straight away. 40.849 last time round, bit of a wiggle on the front end, gets it under control, heads up, Bendigo Bank to SBG, 38.840, now getting up to speed, took a few laps to get there, but get there she has, carefully does it, now heads through Ludby Cart Supplies once more. As Group 2's get themselves ready to come out for the next heat race. And right now, Sophie Hay gets the white flag. Up the hill she goes. And it was a 37.977 that time. Not quite on the pace she's been previously. Round she comes once more then and ready to take the checker flag. This will be time done. And Sophie Hay on her own on circuit trying to beat a 37.977 over the line and gets a 37.303. So that was Sophie's time to shine. Back with the next live feed very soon.